Hi, this is Marco for Moving Your Future, the podcast that tells you all about the innovations that will change your mobility. Today, I'm with Pascal Hermont, Research and Innovation Director for Valeo's Thermal Systems. Hello, Pascal. Hello, Marco. Thank you for being with us. So today we're going to talk about electric mobility and by tackling a very specific aspect that is not often mentioned, but that is absolutely essential. I'm talking about intelligent thermal systems dedicated to electrification. So first question, Pascal, why are thermal systems so essential to the electrification of vehicles? It's very simple, Marco. Without adapted thermal systems, there cannot be efficient electric mobility. Let me give you a first example. It's essential from a safety point of view because of the battery cooling systems. It prevents the risk of overheating or even the risk of the vehicle catching fire. It's also extending the battery's lifetime and its level of performance over time. Second, it's essential also to ensure the thermal comfort of passengers while preserving the vehicle's autonomy. Clearly, I think nobody wants to have a choice between the range of the car and using heating or air conditioning system when they need it. And for that, we need technologies capable of creating electrically heating and cooling the air while consuming a very little energy. So finally, you see it's essential to optimize the charging speed also, and for fast charging, you need a powerful battery cooling system to avoid drifting of the charging rate. So all in one, thermal systems are key for electric mobility quality. Thank you, Pascal. Very clear. Could you give us one or two concrete examples of the benefits of these technologies in order to fully understand what's at stake? Yes. If we take the example of an electric car that has a range of 450 kilometers, You drive this car in winter at, let's say, 7 degrees outside temperature. Naturally, at such a low temperature, you turn on your heating systems and not just a little. Well, without an intelligent thermal system, the range of your car will drop by 40%. It means you will lose 200 kilometers of range. In this same vehicle... If it's equipped with our heat pump system and our intelligent comfort algorithm, it will allow you to just heat up what is needed on your body or the number of passengers, and then you will regain automatically 110 kilometers of range. It's a lot. Wow. And what's more, in the same vehicle, if it's equipped with our powerful battery cooling systems, it will only take you 15 minutes to recharge Otherwise, it can take you more than one hour. Thank you very much, Pascal. What are the main areas of innovation you're currently working on to go even further in this field? You're right, Marco. We need to always go further. And our research and innovation centers are focused mainly on reducing carbon emissions and carbon footprints. This is obviously fundamental for a group like Valeo, which aims to make mobility cleaner and wants to contribute to carbon neutrality by 2050. So we are working on a new battery cooling technology using a dielectric fluid. This will significantly improve the battery cell's cooling capacity, which is key during fast charging, and which will also increase the battery's lifetime. In the meantime, these systems will reduce carbon footprint compared to our current cooling systems that are made of about 20 kilograms of aluminium. We are launching a partnership with Total Energy, who is proposing such high-performance electric fluid. In the same way, we are also looking to reduce the weight of the car's structural parts that protect the cabin during the crash. And we are replacing steel or aluminium by a composite material that is 30% lighter and has a better CO2 footprint. So concretely, Pascal, how much are we talking about here? Yeah, if we take the example of a bolster, we can reduce by 150% the carbon footprint of this part compared to the existing one, which is in aluminium. Likewise, we reached 82% of carbon footprint reduction on a rear bumper beam for an Asian customer. 
Finally, a new intelligent and ultra-compact heat pump system is also under development that integrates all the components, valves, pumps, heat exchangers, and reducing the weight by 20%. It is a solution that has everything to become a new reference on the market and which, thanks to its modular architecture and easy integration and compactness, will allow car makers to completely rethink the architecture of the vehicle. This heat pump technology truly positions us as a system builder capable of offering a complete turnkey system. And this is obviously what our customers are increasingly looking for. So what do these technologies imply in terms of changes in skills and the types of profiles Valeo is looking for? Historically, Marco, our skills were really focused on mechanics. And with the electrification of vehicles, our skills are evolving more and more towards electronics, software, mechatronics. It is a real transformation, which of course requires a shift and an increase in the skills of our employees, as well as new profiles in our recruitment. In this respect, we are lucky to be able to capitalize on the very meaning of our mission, And with electrification, we are directly contributing on our own scale to changing the world. And this is really a plus in attracting talents. So if you're an expert in electronics, mechatronics or software, and your dream of contributing to the development of cleaner mobility, Valeo is a wonderful playground, especially as our innovation projects are absolutely fascinating. I see. Well, I, I might send my, my CV on, on mm -hmm. that. <laughs> Please welcome. <laughs> How do you see the market for thermal systems for vehicle electrification evolving in the coming years? Electrification is accelerating every day. Electric mobility is projected to increase by an average of 30% per year by 2027. The electric or thermal market, as a result, is growing rapidly it will increase almost sixfold to reach 40 billion by 2032. The average content of our thermal systems in vehicle will even triple compared to the average content of our thermal systems in combustion cars. Today, 75% of the orders we receive for, from our customers for thermal systems are directly linked to electrification. So yes, this is obviously a major plus for Valeo since the activity will be completely outsourced by automakers who already have a lot on their plate with electric propulsion, autonomous driving, connectivity, software and many other things. Thank you very much, Pascal. Thank you, Marco. You've been listening to Moving Your Future, the podcast that sheds light on the mobility of tomorrow. Find us on Valeo.com, Deezer and Spotify. And be sure to follow us on LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook and Instagram for the latest news. See you soon. Mm -hmm.